Hey guys, this is Ninja Thaw 64. Oh yeah, it's Pearl. Oh yeah. Okay, so yeah, Clay's gonna be you know tagging along with us this time. So let's go up here, and we just got out of the first world, and in this part, what? Most <laughs> retarded looking game ever. Okay. Anyway, so we just got out of the first world, and here we're gonna go to our first no note door, but not without talking to bottles, because you know that's what he loves to do, and he never shuts up. So I'm gonna speed this up like I normally do, because I don't ever talk to bottles. So, Clay, see any good movies lately? No, but I did hear about this thing called Sim City Road. It's a piece of shit. Oh, okay. Um. So yeah, would you mind telling them about Sim City Road? Okay. Well, you're not casual at all. So. <laughs> okay, so we just opened our first note door, and we're gonna go through this area. <laughs> that door was easy. You got past. Unfortunately, you're first and last. <laughs> Grunty thought it was funny too. Boys, so shut up. Okay, so here's the puzzle to World Two. Uh, the first one we opened only needed one puzzle piece. This one needs two puzzle pieces. Magic. To remove pieces that already put... Okay, he's just telling us to press the down C button to remove pieces. Not that you'd ever want to do that, but okay. <laughs> okay, here's world two. And this is called Treasure Trove Code. Love it. Now we just gotta go find it, because it's not as easy as last time where the puzzle was right next to the door. So let's see. Uh <laughs> We need to go up here. Let's go. Alright, so Clay. <laughs> Tell Wait wait oh Grunty got cut off. Okay, so would you like to tell these people about uh, Sim City Rome? Yes, okay. Sim City Rome is your, like, the story mode is basically your, a guy, a Roman dude, going up in the ranks. You just start a tiny town and then grow some, oh, I about to say grow some goats. You have to have some goats and make some stuff and do all this shit and it's boring as hell. And then you just like go up through the ranks and you get bigger cities and it boring. really it really is boring. Nope. We we got that game we got this game from <laughs> from uh, Goober. Yeah, from the library, from the school library for five dollars. It was not even worth five dollars. Cause here we go with world two. This is Treasure Trove Cove, like I said. Ahoy there! <laughs> this be Treasure Trove Cove. Okay, shut up, Marcus. We really don't care. Now if you look down there, down below us in the water is the blue Jinjo. Um, yeah. <laughs> Problem is, if we go into that water, sharks will try to kill us, so we gotta get in and get out real fast, so let's do that. No, 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 oh, crap. Crap, okay. That was the first hit of this level. Lovely. <laughs> so, Clay, just to give the audience some perspective, have you ever played this game? I have not, and I do not plan on ever doing it because it looks like. Ugh, it looks kind of stupid. Oh, well. The fanboys are gonna hate you for that. Just say, oh my god, I might die! That would be embarrassing if I died right here. No, ah! No. We're gonna cut those out. What's wrong, Banjo? Is it tough? Let me know when you've had enough! Okay, if you guys were making bets about when I would die, I was expecting maybe world 5 or 6. Okay, wow, your best goat score is 4! Great! Okay, so people were probably gonna guess about 4, 5, 6, maybe 7. I, said I never would I never would've guessed 2, but whatever. I would've. Let's just, let's just go with it. On the bright side, I died near the very beginning, so I don't have to pick up that many extra notes. So let's go. Whatever. I'm, I'm keeping that in. I'm not gonna pretend I never died. Okay, so we got the Jinjo. Jinjo. Wow, that, that really just screwed my... That really messed with my mojo. I can't believe I just died in World 2. Okay, whatever. So here is the first Jinji. Jinji. There's too much. There's too many things to start with J. In <laughs> it looks like we're a retarded crab. This is the first uh, Jiggy of this world. He has down. <laughs> 
Okay, so, yeah, it's, it, this is the boss battle of this world. It's pretty easy, actually. All you gotta do is, uh, peck his eyes three times. <laughs> a boss right off the bat. But, yeah. Oh! Yeah, these stupid keys are mixed up. Okay, here we go. He's gonna try to get you with his claws, but you just run in and you do the feet attack thing. You do that three times. You hurt. Never. And he gets faster each time. <laughs> Never. <laughs> Never. And he implodes. <laughs> so let's go in his Bella. shell. <laughs> Fella? So let's go in his shell. Let's go talk to him. Uh, oh, well, hey, you just passed your best note score. Shut up, bottles. So if we go down this really boring corridor. Okay, now we're in his shell, and he's not in here. And Except for these little except this baby. crab bastards. But I might die again. Okay, got one. No! <laughs> no! These emulators, man. Okay, there we go. That was that was just shitty performance right there. I'm sorry, guys. Well, there's another thing. Yeah, I know. They don't ever go away. Yeah, that's the thing about uh, honeycombs. The the health in this game, when you kill enemies, the honeycombs that they drop don't ever go away, like ever. So if you want to save it until later in the level, if you need it, you can leave it there and come back, which is kind of cool. You'd think for the N64 they wouldn't have had enough memory to do that kind of shit, but whatever. <laughs> and if we go back here, let's see what. Can I move the camera? Okay, there. It goes, sort of. Yeah, there we go. There's a Mumbo token. Uh, yeah, Mumbo's not in this world actually. <laughs> Mumbo. He's uh, and he's not in the next one either. I don't know why he just doesn't show up, but. Yeah, he won't be in the next world, or the world after that. So, but you still want to collect as many Mumbo tokens as you can, because, you know, you're going to need them eventually. Go <sighs> on, Will, you can do it! I know I can, Clay, I don't need you to patronize me. Okay, so, yeah. So, if we go over here, and hop up on these boxes, we can learn one of the new moves for this world. Right here. Alright. What do you got from the bottles? You'll reach new heights with my shock jump spring. Okay, I don't care. Anyway, so yeah, Kazooie does all the work. Like, that pretty much sums up the whole game. Kazooie does all the work in this entire game. Like I said earlier, like all the new moves you get, they're all for Kazooie. Like, Banjo does shit. All he does is walk around. That's it. And even that isn't really too helpful, considering that it's faster to use this. And Kazooie has to carry the fat fucking bear, you know, I mean, it's not, it's not very sufficient. Wait, up here's another Mumbo token. And, uh, yeah. So, oh, no. I hate emulators. GTFO. I hate them so much. Okay, this guy, I might as well show him now. This, I don't remember what this guy's called. I just call him the annoying freaking clam. Because he eats your eggs and your feathers. Because we don't even have any feathers yet. So, in other words, he just eats our eggs right now. And I don't even think... Okay, yeah, you can kill him. But he eats your eggs if he attacks you. Which is annoying. <laughs> Do I need to show you that? Gotcha. I'll show you anyway. Yeah, you shoot them. Or you can go behind, like that. Actually, we need to we need to do that right now for this jiggy. Perfect timing. Okay, let's see. If I can get the camera to work with me. Work with my camera. There we go. Me leaky. No good for water. Can bear block hole with pebble? Uh, sure. <laughs> Wait, no. Leaky patched up. Now empty water for bear. Oh, well, that's great. So now the water magically drains from this pit because we put shit eggs <laughs> in a bucket. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> I, I don't know. Nintendo logic. Uh, yeah, that is pretty significant Nintendo logic. Anyway, now we got more notes. I said that the notes would be a lot harder to get in these newer levels. And, you know, at this point, if it were the first world, we'd already have, like, 40 fucking notes. So that proves true. 
And well, here we go. We're going to get a few more. We've got 19 now. Hey, furball. You're looking wise. Solve my puzzle and win a prize. Oh, all right. <laughs> Words with friends. Um, I don't get it. What do we have to do? <laughs> well, maybe that has something to do with it. Well, for you, uh, first grade viewers out there, no, no offense to you. I'm, I'm, the bee? I'm, the bee? I'm just assuming you guys don't know what we have to do. You have to ground pound all of these in order. In 100 seconds! <laughs> to the end, Will! <laughs> Alright, to the end. Alright, now to the J. Yeah, this is really easy. Even on an emulator. I mean, I don't understand how anybody could mess, it. Could mess this up. <laughs> okay, Banjo. Where's the K? Where's the K, Clay? <gasps> There's the K! There it is! Okay, K... I'm on board! I'm on board! They don't know about that, do they? No. Okay, so huh. at one point we were going to do a uh, video <laughs> game review of Skyward Sword. And we were kind of doing it very cheesily, might I add. And we pretty much got to the point where we were talking about Skyloft. You know, that's basically the main area of the game if you've never played it. And about how you fly around. And I was like... You know, Skyloft's basically an island in the clouds. And how do you get around these islands? And then Clay, Clay jumped in. And the way he said it made him <laughs> sound, like, so mental. Like, how did you say it, Clay? I don't even remember. It was, like, really dirtish. I love my mind! Yeah, it was like that. Anyway, so we got the E, and now we gotta fight this crab. This is, like, the king of all the crabs that want to kill me. And did that one time. So, you gotta ground pound this guy. Not just once, but twice. Oh, no, no, but, oh! Uh, little bastard, come here. No, no, no! Uh, no! Can you... Douche. Okay. Noob. What the heck? Noob. Okay, that's not even fair. Okay, I got him. And look, I could have swore he was right there. No! Oh my god, I'm about to die again, aren't I? Okay, got him. Oh, okay. <laughs> this is awesome. Okay, I'm not even gonna kill him. I'm just gonna let him chase me over here, and then I'm gonna run away from him. Run away! <laughs> okay, I'm gonna get this jiggy. And we're gonna do another jig for our jiggy, and I'm gonna get the hell out of here. Leave me alone, you little prick! Okay, well... I guess that wraps it up for this episode. So, uh, yeah, this has been Ninja Sloth 64. That's plural. And, uh, we'll see you next time. Bye.